I'm Bryant Goulding, uh, co-founder, vice president of sales and marketing here at Ryan Geist Brewery. I think we assembled the right team focused on quality, focused on culture, focused on innovation. Our, our people are our, our most important asset, and I think that is something that will continue to define us as a brand and as a company, and in our partnerships as a supplier as well. We're energetic, we like to do a lot of planning, we're pretty hyperactive, we're pretty passionate, we like to follow through, we expect that out of, out of others. And I think that that's been a differentiator. The Midwest has been parched and was really thirsty and aching for a, a new brand to sweep through. And I think we see that happening in other cities, but Cincinnati with the heritage here was an amazing opportunity to strike, to, to basically reflect and respect history at the same time that we could brew the modern beers that we were really excited about. Rheingeist Brewery means Ghost of the Rhine or Spirit of the Rhine. The building that we are based in is a 112,000 square foot brewery that was Christian Moorline's bottling plant, turn of the century. Um, this building was built in 1895. Our mark and everything surrounding it, Rheingeist was guttural German, speaking back to those, uh, the styles that were brewed back then in this brewery. But it's also um, the skull drop that you see here on our, our logo is a drop of history in every batch. Every day that we brew here, we kind of remember the way things were done hundreds of years ago and enjoy that spirit of kind of continuing that tradition forward. And I think that passion for bringing families together for beer and, and sharing, sharing great memories and sharing life over a beer is an important part of culture here. And I think differentiating yourself means doing something unique and whether that's quality or innovation or the combination of those, but, but telling the story is really the only way that you're going to stand out on the shelf besides visually, which we're, we're aiming to do as well. But that storytelling and, and the understanding that we have in our partnership, I think has been the key to success. Understanding what beers fit in which accounts and how to use our beers and the information and the stories that we tell about them to inform and educate accounts and bring them into craft if they aren't yet or deeper into craft as we grow and innovate with a bunch of different styles. And I think you guys are, have been well attuned. Our small voice as, a, as one company has grown with the sales team deeper into the state of Kentucky. And as we're seeing with an early, very successful read up north, um, we can only tell our story as well as we can, one person at a time. But with our partnership and your team, that story gets told like, I picture every time we have a sales team come back to the brewery, it's like we're relighting our torches to go back and show the light to the masses. And I feel like with our partnership, we do that on a daily basis. It never gets old. You know, seeing the tap handle pulled, it's, it's awesome to be able to, to pursue and work in a way that so positively impacts one person at a time enjoying a beer.